In this video, I'll show you how to upload a custom wallpaper from a USB drive on your Xbox Series S or X. First thing, get a USB drive, format it in NTFS. Okay, this is very important. Then transfer, transfer your wallpaper on it, connect it to your Xbox, could be in the front port or in the back port. Once you connect it, you should see this message appearing here. Uh, to have access to the images there, you're gonna go into the settings menu of the Xbox, go down and system, then go into storage devices. Then from here, you're gonna select your USB drive that should be appearing all under uh, internal storage here. Press on it. And here we have uh, a few options. Maybe you have more options. You just need to select view contents. Now from here, um, a new app will open up. It's the media player app. If you do not have currently this app, the media player app, it will ask you to download it. Okay, so you won't get this screen. It will ask you to download media player app. Go ahead and download it because if not, you won't be able to access your USB drive. Then once you're on this screen, press A. Now, these are all the images that are currently on my um, USB drive. Select the one that you want as a wallpaper. Let's say it's this one. By pressing A, you'll be able to open it. Press this button over here on your controller. You'll get this message, select the last one. And you may get this error message saying that, hey, please try again, there's a problem. I don't know why it gives you this error because this image is now your wallpaper. Okay, if I go back, 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 here we go. The wallpaper has now changed. And if I go back in the media player, okay, like this and select um, another image and do the same exact thing, it will give me again this error message. But if I go back, it's changed. So you just have to disregard the error message. Uh, so yeah, this is it. This is how you change your wallpaper of your Xbox using a USB thumb drive. And when you're done, you just have to disconnect the USB drive and this is it. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.